Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to do the all proof conversion. So on this mission, Mountain Cloud Boys, it's another opportunity without on mission zero. This time it is repeatable unlike the one from the Green Saber. Okay, you can fail the mission and repeat it as many times as you like. So it's pretty cool. And yeah, sometimes you may... There will be vehicles down the stairs. Um, sometimes they will not spawn. You do want them to. It just will definitely help. It's very unlikely you would do this without them. Because you want to get away from Ruzi at some point. So once you lose him, you won't be able to fail the mission. But yep. So you're at this part. You want to take out these guys. Um, all except for one. Usually you leave the one... Uh, behind the wall because he really doesn't interact until you get close to him so yeah it's easy to take these guys out without interfering with them and you won't be able to accidentally shoot him so it's perfect and yeah take everyone out you will see the sniper on the roof you can take him out too take everyone out you see except for the guy that you can't see behind the wall. Okay, I've taken out all except for one. Make sure Woozy doesn't really get in the car. You don't want him to drive by the guy. Use the sentinel to put and use it to like keep the guy on the under it, you know. So just make sure he's under the car. Okay, keep stay away from Woozy. Um so, hopefully, yep, vehicles do spawn here. Not all the time they will. If they don't, you might want to reload. Because, basically, it will help you get away from Woozy. Now it says this. Take out the remaining. And then, if it says Woozy, if you left them behind, go back and get them. Then the mission won't fail. Because, if you stay far away from the target, and... After a while, the game will, f the mission will fail. But if it says woozy as well, if you left them behind too, then it won't. I'll need this vehicle to get into Transfender. I'm not sure about the elegy, but this one will definitely get me in. And I'll need a similar vehicle. To get out, like anything that will not be rejected from the transfender. You get in and you immediately pass through the mission like it will automatically kill the guy under the car. Okay, now um, this is kind of hard in my opinion, um, just a bit, because of these invisible guys they're in their cars and they can run you over which is kind of annoying you have to kill woozy now at this point to fail the mission yeah it's just annoying though yeah well the vehicles you can't really see much i have to kill woozy at this point oh dear oh my health it's fine i'm still alive Okay, where's Woozy? Here he is. Um, oh wait. Oh, there he is, actually. Just get to him and shoot him. Easy. And then you fail the mission. Now, you have to blindly navigate your way to an interior. Most likely the school, the driving school down there. That is perfect. Um, if you have the uh, uh, safe house north, kind of north of the uh, s driving school, it's like near Doherty, you know. But yeah, you could use that as well. But yeah, it's not that hard. You, once you're close to the construction site at Doherty, you can actually see it. So you'll see the Doherty garage, and then that will definitely help you get to the driving school. And here's a crane. So you just go south, you 
kind of see your mini map. I can kind of. It's a bit like dark um, due to the mod menu. But yeah, the you can still navigate. You can see the north point and the blip of the driving school. And yeah, just follow down here. Okay, so if you get to this point, you might see if you haven't bought the uh, safe house here, like I have, you'll see the safe house icon. That means you can buy it, but I haven't. I think I can buy it now. I don't know. And I can use that as an interior. But yeah, near this place is definitely the driving school. Wait. Okay, let's see. Purchase the property. Where's the button, though? Whatever. It doesn't matter. I don't need to buy it. It said I can, but... Uh, you... I guess you can, but I'll go to the driving school. Uh, it's around here. You just gotta search, really. Uh... I think I went past it, actually. Okay, that... It's around here, though. Okay. Just go along the wall. And then you'll find the door. There we go. And, uh, make your way back out. And then you'll be able to see everything probably now. So, next job. If you're on, like, a console or so, or PC, you want to go north. But you have to go on foot on those. Mobile, it's completely safe. Because the exit vehicle button and enter vehicle button is different to the exit mod shop button. They're two separate. Unlike uh, PC or console. They share the same button. Triangle for PlayStation, you know. And yeah. But anyways, you go north because that's one of my girlfriend's. Um, you have the girlfriend, one is Kate, that goes, you find up north their house, and then once uh, they are available, we can perform the all-proof conversion. I also forgot to mention, um, this is pretty limited on mobile, same as the one from the Green Saber, I already covered it. That you have to convert the one that you use, that the vehicle you use to get out of uh, the mod garage transfender. Because once you get out of that vehicle, you won't be able to get in any other vehicle. So you must convert the one that you got out of the transfender with. Okay, very limiting, but most vehicles, like, there's a, quite a few, or quite a lot. Of vehicles that are accepted from uh, transfenders. So, yeah, just sh uh, select one. But yeah, this is only for mobile. It's now available. So, yeah, I had to wait like at least over 10 minutes or so. Yeah. But I was patient. I was like, yeah, I just want to get it done. And here we are. Ooh. Oh dear. Oh. Oh gosh. Kate, get out. Oh. Oh, that was catastrophic. Boom. But I think girlfriends survive. They're like explosion proof, which is good in a way. So, yeah, we need to pick her up. Come on. Complete the date. And also, using this conversion, it does remove the script of the jealous girlfriend. So if you have more than one girlfriend, you know, it will disable that. So just keep that in mind if you want to alter vehicle, alter girlfriend vehicle. Okay. So I think the land stalker can exit transfer, so I'll convert this vehicle. 
it should be perfect for the job. So your next step is to go to back to their home. And then they'll ask you for coffee and then, you know, uh, before doing that, you uh, exit the mod garage so you can free roam again. Just like that, okay. So this is accepted from the transfender. So uh, I'm gonna find a body of water, a suitable one. Um, so I can preserve the old roof property. I could go all the way to Los Santos, that's pretty far. Yeah, it would take time to drive there, you know. I don't wanna waste too much time. Uh, I think I got a good spot in mind. I do have an idea. I have not used it yet, but in theory, I think it will work. I really think it will. Okay, so hopefully you know where I am. It's uh, at the countryside. Um, there is a an oyster located around here, so hopefully you're familiar. This seems to be deep enough, and hopefully this works out. Accept the coffee when you're in the water, and then let the cutscene do its thing, you know. Okay. So, it does seem to be deep enough, and it didn't actually, like, go down or slide off the this part, so I'm, I think this was okay, you know. It was my first time trying this spot, too. I had a good idea about it, but I was just never actually got to got the time to use it. But it, yeah, it seems to work out with this land stalker. And yeah, the next job is to get it out of the water. Hopefully, it has preserved the old property properties, and uh, I think it has. Um, it did look deep enough once the cutscene ended. So yeah. I really hope this worked out. Alright. Think I'll use firepower. Extra firepower to get it out. That was okay. And yeah, it has received some damage, like crashing while getting here. And I shot it like that. So I do think it is all proof. I'll just confirm the properties soon. Okay, I'm gonna go to a garage. Uh, this seems to be the closest right now where I am. Alright, we're here. Oh! Oh, I did not re rem remember about that. I completely forgot about this tow truck being in here. Um, it was used for one of the sp other special vehicles I've demonstrated on how to obtain. So, yeah. I kept it ever since. But yeah. It's not needed anymore. Uh, so. Just store the vehicle you have converted. And you have definitely. Obtained it. You've converted the vehicle you wanted to. And yeah. Su success you know. But. Just to make sure the properties. Because it has to be deep enough. In order to keep the old proof properties. That's the thing. Okay, there's a gas station here. Let's see if it blows up. Oh! Yes, it's definitely old proof. It's explosion proof, as you saw. It's not on fire. It did not receive any knockback or explosion damage. That's it. Okay, more properties. Okay. Here we go. Seems to be bulletproof. Indeed. Nice. Okay. So I have already tested the explosion proof. Um, I'll use, show you fireproof, damage proof. And yeah. Okay, I won't actually explode the satchels just yet, you know. Cause this big fire to really show that it is fireproof. 
Okay. So it should be on fire by now, but... But, it is indeed fireproof, so it's safe. It's completely immune to that. Let's get it away from the flames. Just like that. Anyways, uh, damage proof, I'm just gonna crash a bit, you know. Just into walls. Right here. No dance, man. No dance. Hopefully that has convinced you that it really does work. Look at that. And that is the old proof conversion, okay? Just, yeah. It's repeatable. Doesn't need on Mission Zero. Um, well, let me know your thoughts on this conversion. Is it nice? Or is it, like, still a cheating way? I don't know. But anyways, it is still helpful. And I'll show you the reason why mobile is very limited. Okay. So, getting to the marker right here. And then, we're gonna leave the mod garage. There we go, left, and yeah, let's go to a vehicle we want to convert, eh? So, here's a taxi, I've been meaning, I've been wanting to convert it. Okay, let's get in. Hey, where's the enter vehicle button? Yeah, that's right. It's not possible, it's very limited, that is why, this is exactly why you must convert the vehicle that you use to get out of Transfender with. It's the only way, even by drink, you go into this vending machine, you take a drink, but it really doesn't help you get back into vehicles. It sucks. So... Yeah, it's very limiting on mobile. I'm gonna just end the date. And vo voila, I can enter vehicles once again. So, yeah, it is a bummer on mobile, but yeah, that's it. Just had to let you know.